it seem like we feel the same We love what we hate We lie, but we know We can't wait to win. How to trust that God knows all your needs Hello friends, this is Yundel and today's share is about trusting it all to God that God knows all your needs. Many of us are worried we don't feel safe and secure because we are struggling of something in our life. The food, the shelter, the bills needed to be paid, and so on and so forth. We all have needs in our life. But I've been sharing with you many times that you have to take it to the Lord in prayer. And before that, you prayed for your problems and your needs. God knows it all already. He knows what we need and He is going to provide what we need. But He wants us to communicate with Him. He wants us to ask Him about it. He wants us to do the asking in order for us to have a constant communication with God. Most of us believe in God, right? We believe what God has done in our life. He is with us, He is working for us, He is guiding us. And all we have to do when we needed something is to take it to the Lord in prayer. We all can do that. You can do that through your prayers. Even though God knows already what we need, but still He wants us to ask Him. This is about your relationship with Him. To have a constant relationship with God through our prayers, that is what He wants us to do. If you really want to get what you need in your life right now, the good health, the financial, all the things, it's already been lined up. God will give that to you, but He wants us to ask it from Him. He wants us that we're going to verbalize it. We want to communicate with Him through our prayers. And of course, He will give us time to be prepared. Therefore, it takes time that our prayer will be answered. Our prayer will be answered as soon as possible when it is really, really needed. And believe me, God knows it all already. He wants us to do the right thing. Therefore, He wants us to wait. He wants us to develop up the patience to understand that patience is a virtue and with patience there is a reward therefore most of the time when we are asking from God he wants us to let us wait waiting is the key here and while you are in the waiting period of time you must just keep praying doing the right thing practicing patience here is very very important with that you are showing to god how people you are how badly you need the thing you are asking for he knows already everything about us. He knows already what we need and what we want. And with the right perfect divine timing, He will grant our wish. He will grant our desire. So do not worry. Keep asking. Keep praying. 
keep believing and develop a strong faith in Him, knowing that in its perfect divine timing, He will give that to you of what you are asking for. Trust in the Lord with all your heart. God knows your need. And the Bible says in Psalms 37, 4, Take delight in the Lord and He will give you the desire of your heart. Now some people interpret this to mean that as long as they're good Christians, God will give them whatever you want and whatever they want. But the truth is, not everything you want is good for you. God knows what you need and what will make you happy. If God give you everything you asked for with no regard as to whether or not it was good for you, it wouldn't bring you the joy you hope for. God knows the end from the beginning. And He alone knows yourself. You can trust that He will answer your prayer with the best interest in your heart. In Matthew 6, 8 tells us, Your Father knows what you need before you ask Him, as you can be sure that God knows the difference between what you need and what you want. He sees the big picture here which includes every one aspect of your life. Sometimes, the lines between what you desire and what you actually need get blunt. So remember to pray and ask God to take control of your life. He is the one who will lead you and guide you. So do not worry. Pray without ceasing. Keep asking Him, what is that? The desire of your heart. And you can be sure that God knows the difference of what you really need in your life. Sometimes the lines between what you desire and what you actually need get blurred so remember to pray and ask God to take control of your life and then put your full faith and trust in Him. As it says in Psalms 34, 10, The young lions lack and sulfur hunger, but those who seek the Lord shall not lack any good thing. As it says in Matthew 6, 31-32, Therefore do not worry, saying, What shall we eat, or what shall we drink, what shall we wear? For after all these things the gentle seeks, for your heavenly Father knows what you need all these things. God knows already what you need, as it says in Psalms 84, 11, For the Lord God is a son and shield. The Lord will give grace and glory. No good thing he will withhold from those who walk uprightly. So keep trusting God. Keep believing God. Keep asking God what are the desire of your heart and he will grant it when he really no, the right thing, the right time will come. So do not worry. God will provide all of your needs according to His riches. You have to trust God that is working behind the scenes for your behalf. For me, in my own understanding, when it comes to this matter, just God wants us to be near Him all the time. He wants us that we call upon Him every day, communicating with Him every day. Therefore, even He knows already what we need. He wants us to come unto Him for a word of prayer. So, don't worry. Keep trusting Him. Keep 
asking him what is the desire of your heart because he will give that to you in its perfect divine timing the key here is really about constantly communicating with god through our prayers and meditations i am sharing this with you because this is my spiritual lifestyle in my day-to-day -day life i have to call upon him to lead me and guide me every day so my day will be fine so my day will be safe and secure i know that god knows already all of my needs but still i call upon him because he wants me to communicate with him every day this is just a share from my own understanding of what i have read in the scripture i am not perfect i am still working with myself and i am sharing this with you in hope it can help you too this is yundel thank you for listening thank you for dropping here in my channel i am very grateful to each and every one of you supporting me here in my life journey i love you all and bye bye like we feel the same when you